Hey guys, I have a really unique project that I'm really excited to share. I'm sure you've seen those magic tricks where the magician asks the audience to pick a card, put it back on the deck, shuffle it up, and then magically, he was able to find that card that the audience picked. So this is like that, except with an Arduino. Before we get to the psychic part, let me explain what's going to happen. So instead of a deck of card, we're going to use a random number generator. Every time I press this button, it's good. Oh, you can't see that. That's better. Every time you press this button, it picks a random number. And actually, uh, I only need two digits, but I don't have a two digit seven segment display. So I use a three digit and I didn't even bother wiring the third one. So yeah, every time you press this button, the left button, it's going to pick a random number. So let's say we like this number. So I'm going to write that down. This is the number we pick. And then we press the other button to indicate that's the number we pick, 82. And then the magic begins. So we press this in again, looking for another random number. 78 is not 82. So we press it again. 48 is not 82. Press it again. 71 is not 82. We press again. Aha, that's our number. And when we press it again, it will blink to indicate that is the number we pick. So that's how this button works. You just basically remember which one you pick. But since you guys aren't here to pick a random number, and I could see the number I pick, it's pointless for me to perform this magic trick. So let me introduce you to the psychic. <laughs> let's power him up. And let's pick another random number. I don't know. 93. So we say we pick that number, hides it from a magician, which is pointless because this magician have no eyes. <laughs> but we'll pick another random number, random number. So 51. We know it's not 51, it's 93. I better cross that one out. That was from before. Let's see if he actually knows that it is not 51. 51. Oh, he knows it's not 51. Good job, psychic. <laughs> 82. He's doing pretty good so far. I hope it showed up soon because <laughs> I don't want it to be a two hour video. So zero seven. No, it's not 93. 49. Nope, okay. Hey, here's 93, our number. Let's see if he knows. Moment of truth, 93. Excellent. <laughs> I don't know, it's a cool trick. So I will share how this is done and how you could make one yourself. You could just make this part and perform the trick. Oh, by the way, yeah, of course it will blink. Or you can make both and do exactly what I just showed. I think either one is pretty cool. But in the meantime, see if you could figure out how this is done. I do editing, but the, there's no camera trick to make the trick work. As you saw, the chosen number reappear randomly as well. I should have counted how many times it appears here uh, and how many times it appears here, but that's random too. There are no hidden chips on the, underneath here. There are a couple of resistors for the LED, but there are no other components. And actually, I could show you the schematic. And you could pause the video and study it if you like. Oh, and speaking of schematic, huge thanks for my friend Tony for discovering errors in my schematic. So thanks, Tony. Okay, now I'm going to break one of the rules of magic. Don't show a trick more than once. But I think this makes it even more amazing. So we're going to power off the psychic while we pick another random number. For good measure, I'm also gonna turn that off and turn it back on. And every time it comes on, you can see it comes up with a different random number. 31. There's no sequence here, it's just random numbers. And then of course, you can press this as long and as many times as you want. So even if, if I have a, the right sequence, these are all going to be different. So maybe we'll keep track of one. So I'm gonna turn it on. It's 36, press that, 25, 56. Okay, I'm going to turn it off, turn it back on, and it better not come up with the 36. Okay, it comes up with 31, press it again, it's 90, 20. So it comes up with random numbers. Every time it powers up, it uses a different random seed uh, from analog zero. That's how it comes up with these random numbers. So let's say we pick this number, 20. 
do the same thing again. And then we'll wake up the psychic. He suspects nothing. <laughs> Let's pick another random number, 27. It's not 20. 27. Nope. Next one, 47. Nope. 98. Nope. 65. Yeah, I should be counting how many. They're, they're random. Uh, sometimes it appears in three times. Sometimes it appears in nine times, whatever. It, it's random. Okay, 65. 42. Yeah, you can see this. This is going a lot longer. Here is our 20. Good job, Psychic. I think it's amazing. So post comment if you think you know how this is done. And as I said, it's not the nth number. I mean, you saw how many times it gets this one. And these are just regular nanos, as I said. Nothing is hacked. These are original nanos, original displays, original uh, buttons, original batteries. Oh, and this guy's not doing anything. <laughs> and these are independent of each other. It's like they're not connected at all. If you want to know how it works or if you want to build one yourself, check out my next video. And you could build one too. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the likes. Thanks for all the comments. Love those comments. And if you're new, maybe uh, click that subscribe button and the bell so you will get notified of my future projects. So thanks again. I'll see you next time. Bye.